This depiction of Jesus' resurrection might look familiar. That's because this Perugino masterpiece can usually be seen in the background of papal meetings held in the Library of the Apostolic Palace. There's an account of the various important visits with heads of state from the 70s on up to Pope Francis, so until very recently. It's an artwork that breaks through these important diplomatic meetings with heads of state or kings, queens, princesses, princes. It has an interesting story because it's a work that you can see through the lens of television. Typically only these heads of state see this 500-year-old art piece. But the Vatican Museums were given the piece for a few months on loan to celebrate a very special occasion. This work is here so that we as the Vatican Museums can celebrate the 500th anniversary of Perugino's death, precisely because he died in 1523 of the plague. And we wanted to participate in the Perugino celebrations by giving the public the opportunity to see a work that would otherwise be almost impossible to see. At around 50 years old, Perugino was at the height of his career and considered one of the most famous Italian artists at the time he finished this painting. While he had already completed many frescoes in the Sistine Chapel, Dr. Bifarelli calls this resurrection piece a testament to Perugino's maturity and skill. This work is intended to be a summation of all his previous experiences, and it is indeed a masterpiece because he manages to mix in a very casual and camouflaged way insights that he succeeds in attracting other artists, contemporary and earlier works. Now until September 15th, this historic piece will be on display in the Vatican Museums for everyone to see before it is returned to the privacy of the Papal Palace.